What up, y'all? It's your boy Chance, and right now I am beyond pissed off, and for very good reason. You see, oh god, like I'm gonna wait to invite all y'all up in here so I can explain everything and what's going on. All right, now if you guys don't know. You know, today I've been having a good day. You know, I've been celebrating Thanksgiving. You know, I just had Thanksgiving dinner with my family. And then here in a few minutes, I'm going to be, well, here in a while, I'm going to be hopping on to, you know, FaceTime with my girlfriend and spending Thanksgiving with her through FaceTime since, you know, she can't be here for Thanksgiving, unfortunately. But, you know, I'm sitting there. Yeah, playing some the brand new Killer Instinct that they just released for Xbox One. You know, I'm sitting there playing that. You know, I'll check it out because as you guys know, I'm a huge, you know, Killer Instinct fan, Street Fighter fan. I love those games, grew up on them. So I was playing the new one that they just released, the new update for Killer Instinct. And I was chilling and talking to my girl and stuff and whatnot. And I went to post up a post on Facebook, because if you guys don't know, um, she does have eye surgery next week. She has to have a LASIK eye surgery for her eye, which is the eye that her ex beat her in the head with a hammer and knocked it loose, which then became her bad eye. And she basically became half blind. And I was posting them on Facebook, you know, like, y'all. And this is exactly what I said. I was like, y'all pray for my girl, you know, because, you know, y'all pray for my for my girlfriend because, you know, next week she has LASIK eye surgery for her bad eye to get it fixed and whatnot. And I go to post it, and it literally said, this post goes against community, this and that, and da, da, da. And I'm just like, yo, who the fuck is reporting my shit? And I think I know who it is. And if y'all don't know, there's this guy named Gavin B. All right, I've dealt with this guy for several months. You know, he's made several, several YouTube accounts, you know, messing with me. This guy was actually supposed to be a customer of mine. He won. If you guys don't know the story about Gavin B, allow me to explain. This guy basically came up to me one day because, as you guys know, I do sell, you know, prints and digital downloads of my art. And this guy wanted a commission or sell portrait piece, which during that time I was having artist block. So I wasn't able to do much. And as you guys are very well aware, people like myself don't see game sites like, um, what you call it, like Rin Maru Games, we don't see it as a normal game site. We see those art style things. We basically see those art generators and those picture generators as ways to create art for people. I've done it for several people in the past. And, you know, like, you know, and this kid was like, you know, hey, you know, I want a self-portrait. You know, can you hook me up? And I was like, yeah, sure, not a problem. You know, like I was telling him, you know, like that's not a problem, you know. You know, it's like 10 bucks for, you know, a self-portrait commission, stuff like that. You know, it's all well and good. And I was literally sending this guy screenshots as I'm doing it. So he knows he's not getting fucked over. That he knows, you know, hey, this guy's actually legit. You know, this guy's doing this. And I was sending him screenshots and whatnot, and this guy was, and keep in mind, I did not know this guy was going to pull the fucked up stunt that he, that I'm about to tell you about. And I showed him, like, he liked it. You know, he was, like, he was really hyped up, but he's like, dude, this is really cool, da 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 And then here's where he tricked me. Here's where he really fucked up. He was like, you know, before I send you the money, I have just one question for you. And not thinking about it, I was like, all right, cool, you know, like, what's the question? You know, I thought, like, maybe he had just an in-general question. 
you know, like, you know, like, how do you send the money or something like that? I didn't think that he was going to say what he said, which was, why the fuck are you lying? Why are you being a fake? And he was like, why are you using a game to create it? You're not a real artist and da 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 So what does this guy do after he says that to me? He goes to his timeline, posts about me, telling people not to purchase from me because I'm a fake artist, that I'm not real, that I'm this and that I'm that. And ever since then, this guy has taken every opportunity that he has gotten, you know, not only on Facebook, but he took it to YouTube as well, has several, several accounts, and has basically been harassing me for months on end. On every account that I have, this guy has literally stalked me. You know, he's posted on all my videos, commented on all my stuff, just leaving these hateful, nasty comments. And he keeps on making these different accounts, acting like he's other people, acting like he's somebody else when he's really not. Like, it is super annoying. Um, his main one right now is actually called Race King. You guys can go on my um you guys can go to literally any of my any of my YouTube channels or even go to Bloodshot Records. You guys know the channels. I ain't gotta say them. You know, you guys can go there and you know see this guy's comments on my videos. This guy's done nothing but harass me and try to, you know basically ruined my career and my reputation as a musician and as an artist as well as as a film person as a filmographer like this dude literally has done nothing but stalk me and that's i'm pretty sure that's the guy that reported my stuff so gavin if it is you like i'm pretty sure it is man what the fuck's your issue like, are you out to ruin my career, man? If so, you can try all you want. It's not going to work. And honestly, when you called not only me out, but you called my girl and her kids out. You can call me out all you want, but you call my girl and her kids out, you, fuck, you can fuck with a man, but you fuck with a man's family. And that's crossing the line, my dude. So, I, you, you guys can definitely bet that I will be releasing a diss track on this little punk bitch. Because I've not had enough of this dude's mouth. Like, the minute, and I mean it, man, the minute that you put my family, which is my girlfriend and her three kids, in your mouth and talk shit about them, saying that I need to get away from them, that's where you fucked up. Because I don't play that game. You know, I'm sitting here trying to enjoy a nice Thanksgiving, you know, with my girlfriend and, you know, my mom and my family. And, you know, basically trying to enjoy the best Thanksgiving that I can with my girlfriend in the way that I can right now at this point in time until she can move up here. Because if you guys don't know, she did get a job starting on Monday, next Monday, working at this place called Smash Burger for 10 bucks an hour on graveyard shifts, so she'll be able to save up and, you know, move up here. But like I said, Gavin, you know, you deserve this ass kicking that you're about to get, dude. You deserve the diss track that I'm about to serve you. Because like I said, you can put my name in your mouth all you want, but there's one thing you don't do, and that's bring my girlfriend and her kids into it. This is between me and you, bruh. Not between you and my girl and her kids. If, even if it was between you and my girl and her kids, I would still jump in and beat your little fucking ass. I would still rip on your ass. And so y'all can expect me to fucking crush this little bitch in a new diss track coming soon. Also, in the comments... Be sure to hit that like button, that subscribe button, and that share button on my brand new, and I mean brand fucking new, mashup called Waking Up Under, 
with Evanescence and Suicide Silence, the first ever Evanescence and Suicide Silence mashup. So keep the video, hit that like button, and check it out. But with that being said, y'all, I'm about to pop off here, get this dish track done, take care of this fool, enjoy my Thanksgiving with my girlfriend and my family. Hope y'all are having a better Thanksgiving than I am. Love you guys, and I'll see y'all later. Peace.